A program to keep college students in school was unveiled today at the University of Cincinnati. Nationwide, one third of all college freshmen drop out. And if you are the first in your family to attend college, the challenge is even tougher. Local 12's Jeff Hurst has a look at the new mentoring program for these so-called Gen 1 students. In some ways, the distance between high school and college may not seem that great. Hughes High School behind me is literally across the street from the University of Cincinnati. But while those two are physically very close, the gulf may in reality be huge. I'm very nervous about going on to college because I have no idea how it's going to be or it's going to be a new step in life for me. Destiny Turner and her fellow Hughes High School senior Mackenzie Sullivan are definitely college bound. They're good students. But unlike many other college students here at UC, they don't come from families where parents or siblings have a college degree. I would be the first one to go to college in my family. I'm not the first, but I might be the first, hopefully, to graduate. Making sure such Gen 1 students graduate is what a new mentoring program at UC is all about. Do you think it'll be a little challenging to just navigate everything you have to deal with separate from just classes? Absolutely. I believe so. A lot of people told me that it's a whole different experience than high school. The program for graduates of Cincinnati Public Schools will start small, 40 students and mentors this fall, but should grow to about 600 each within five years. Besides face-to-face -face meetings, there will be a special web portal where mentors and students can communicate. Many first-generation college students are from low-income families. If those students get college degrees, it can help break the cycle of poverty. If you think about the impact of that on their lives, but also the lives of their families and this city, it is enormous. There is a big picture here, but it's one small picture at a time. Yes, it would be very helpful to have a mentor. Yes, very much. I, will, I think I would need a mentor, actually. Jeff Hirsch, Local 12 News. If you're interested in becoming a mentor, the Cincinnati Youth Collaborative will start recruiting this spring. And when they do, we'll let you know so you can sign up.